some dark shit Can't find her some one to Hey, hey, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to Astro Nori for another video. So today, I don't even know what we're gonna be talking about. I don't even know at this point, but I'm gonna go ahead and run through some topics I have on my notes and see what we're gonna end up talking about. But if you guys do end up enjoying this video, go ahead and leave it a like down below. Subscribe to the channel for more content like this and click the post notifications as well, because that means a whole lot and it goes a long way. I know I've been slacking, but I've been kind of picking up the motion little by little. I'm gonna try to go ahead and post this video today. It is like the eighth, I think, or the the ninth now nah, I think it's the eighth I'm gonna go ahead and try and post this later on today if I do get a chance if I don't I apologize man I've been doing a lot I'm, I'm sorry okay I'm gonna cut the camera back on once I figure out what I'm gonna do but I'll catch you guys in the next clip ah! okay so that was faster than I thought today I'm gonna talk about five essentials I feel like every student needs for back to school there's a lot of things that you could go ahead and pick up that you will use for school but this is a streetwear and hype beast channel so I'm gonna go ahead and give you my take on what you need for school this season now without any further ado let's get straight into this video now a couple things that we're gonna be using for the back to school are things that I have set up behind me I'm gonna go ahead and grab them or point at them whenever I do want to talk about them the first thing I feel like you need for back to school obviously is a backpack now when it comes to backpacks supreme makes them bait makes them a lot of companies make backpacks i would recommend you to get a supreme one if you are into the whole hype beast culture but you could also go ahead and use a north face backpack those were the type of backpacks i used to love when i was in school because they're sturdy they last a while and you could beat them up now mind you supreme does collaborations with north face those are a little bit more expensive than the regular backpacks but they do go a long way as far as hype goes as far as the whole aesthetic of it and it's still good materials because it is backed by the North Face. So when it comes to backpacks, I would definitely say go for a Supreme one or a North Face backpack because those are really sturdy. You could go for the TNF backpacks or you could go for the Spring Summer 18 one, which was a really good one in my opinion. It's basically like this bag right here with the Supreme on the sides, but it's on the actual backpack. So that's pretty dope in my opinion. My favorite colorways from the ones that did drop was definitely that tan colorway. I feel like that one is really sick and I don't know why it isn't the one that's selling for the highest price now number one was definitely a backpack this has no specific order I'm gonna just talk about them while they come to my head the second thing that I would definitely recommend if you don't want to carry a backpack or if you're in like senior year or around the end of the school year or something like that like college maybe you could go ahead and get a fanny pack keep your pencils in there something you could pull out real quick and just start working with that's another thing you could go ahead and pick up a fanny pack I have the supreme lacoste one right here I feel like this was definitely a good choice you could also go with the one that dropped for spring summer 18 once again i keep repeating this but those were really dope in my opinion i feel like that would be a really good piece to go ahead and start the school year with because you could throw your phone in there your wallet some things that you could just keep in there real quick that you don't need to carry a whole book pack for like basically if you go on a school trip and you need to bring like a little notebook pencils or whatever you could fold a little notebook put that shit in there boom carry a pencil you're good to go you don't have to carry a whole book bag but number two would definitely be like a fanny pack a shoulder bag something around that area number three I don't know what it would be but let me just think about it real quick all uh, right you do need to stay hydrated when you are in school so I would definitely say get a supreme water bottle get a bait water bottle something like that just to keep you hydrated while it's school time because you do need to drink water water makes your bones flow it makes your body feel better at the end of the day I think I need some water right now to be honest but yeah supreme water bottle would definitely be a dope plus to go ahead and get for your collection this isn't the only one they drop one every year almost so you could go ahead and get one these are pretty dope bait makes them anti-social makes them a lot of companies makes them i don't know if palace has dropped one but you could find these everywhere it doesn't even have to be supreme you could go to target pick up a water bottle that you could just refill every day make that shit cold and you're good to go you feel me for number two i'm gonna talk about something that not a lot of people add into their hype beast back to school list they usually make a separate list for it but i feel like it's still necessary for the back to school list because it is something that you will need each and every single day of school and that would be a pair of sneakers now you want to go with a pair of comfortable sneakers i would personally recommend a pair of vans i have a trash pair of vans right here that i'm gonna show you these are trashed i'm not gonna hold you you could probably not even tell on the camera but these are trashed and i would definitely recommend 
recommend you to go ahead and pick up a pair of Vans. You could trash these and they will look better afterwards. You could also pick up a crispy pair of Vans. You could wear these all year round for school and they're comfortable. You could beat them up. Vans also started making the Ortholite soles ones. So those would definitely be something I recommend for you if you want to stay comfortable during school. You could also go with like Jordans and all those type of sneakers. But this is something I would recommend comfort wise, price wise. They range from like 40 to $80 unless you want to pick up a collab. And those are really hard as well. Like the W Taps collab that just dropped the flame ones. Those shits are super hard. Couldn't get my hands on them, but I don't really care at this point. These are definitely something you will need for back to school. This last thing I'm going to bring up is something that's kind of subjected to whether you have uniform in your school, whether you don't, whether you could wear sweats, whether you can't, whether you could wear slides or you can't. It would be the comfortability of wearing some sweats or a pair of slides or just having them or basically like after school, changing it to something more comfortable because you basically did have a long ass day of work. So you do want to be comfortable on your way home or just, you know, chilling. So I would definitely recommend that if you have a locker in your school, keep a pair of sweats, some slides up in there so you could just get comfortable after school and not have to have the fucking uniform on because that shit is annoying. When I was in school, yo, I used to change every day. I used to be loyal to the fact that I used to change every single day after school, bro. I used to hate that uniform. I'm not even going to hold you. I used to hate uniform. So I would keep some clothes in my locker just so I could be comfortable and feel good after school because you'd never know. Like after school, I used to not go straight back home. So I would be chilling in my clothes and not have to go back home. So I would definitely recommend that if you have a locker at your school, keep some clothes in there. Not something super expensive or super fancy or whatever, but you do want to have something in there that you could just pull out. And if let's say you want to go eat with your friends after school, are you going to go with your uniform? Or are you going to throw on that shirt that you have in your locker? You feel me? That's honestly a really big tip when it comes to school. But that pretty much does it for this video. Let me know if you guys feel like I missed something on this video. If you did, go ahead and leave down below what I missed because I might go ahead and make a part two to this. But with all that out the way, thank you guys for tuning in. Once again, it definitely does mean a lot. Smash that like button down below. Let's see if we can reach 60 likes on this video. Comment what was your favorite piece that I did talk about. Subscribe to the channel for more content like this and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace. Stay up and I'm out. Strikes again, whoa. Some niggas bitter with life and they hate me. They wanna put knife in my ribs, whoa. Way this shit set up, I live like Ronaldo, but I never been in Madrid, whoa. She said that she working, I told her come over and we could get right at the crib, whoa.